Hello everybody, my name is Gudem and welcome back for another video of Humankind. We're going to continue this series. In the last video, if you uh, missed it, go ahead and watch it. You missed a lot, boys. Uh, we went ahead and basically created our first city. We got a f our official first city. Uh, because we entered the new era, so our first era, ancient era, and now we're into our new city. We're going to get our second one uh, because of the outposts and stuff we were building. Two turns still left for that. Uh, so it's basically a two-year thing. Uh, we've got city cap, so I can only get two cities right now. As of right now, I only have the right to do to have two cities. So we're gonna have to make it do with that, but uh, we're still bringing it up. So let's uh, end the turn really quick. We've got a maximum cap of 300 turns that we can do, and now we're at turn 31, boys. So let's see what we can do with these uh, armies. We've got some resources getting by right here. In one turn, we're gonna get Lugenberg. Still got another 11 turns. Uh, only one population uh, really currently working uh, on this. So it's it's normal for us to not really do anything about this. To not be able to do too much. Let's go ahead and get that resource though. We're definitely going to go ahead and attack these guys. So uh, let's do... Uh, I, I'm going to win that anyway. So let's do the victory really quick. Five gold right there. Easy gold. That's just easy money really. To, uh, to get that done. Uh, we uh, also can get another outpost somehow. I just don't know. I guess I can get multiple outposts. But I can't get multiple cities. I guess for cities themselves. I gotta actually uh, wait it out. So hunting party right here. It seems like this one uh, is a really good hunting party. I'm gonna go ahead and keep exploring. Or maybe help out in the north right here. Maybe uh, boost them up together. I imagine that would be a good uh, option. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's go towards that direction. We're going to move that guy right there. Uh, we've got my third army. We're going to start exploring in the in uh, in the south, re really, boys. Start exploring a little bit further. And we've got another army that I got to move. It's got a battle potential right here against that uh, resource. We're going to do instant resolution clear victory uh we gained another five gold from that which is very good now my army needs to heal up a little bit it definitely needs to heal up so uh hold this position on Philly until you give a new order uh this army needs to heal up and i'm not sure how to heal them up though it's kind of uh confusing a little bit for me so cultural blitz immediately bring one of your empire stories back into its sphere of influence so I don't need to do that. I'm pretty sure I don't need to do that right now. So I, I think we're going to be fine. Yeah, we got plenty of stuff we can do. So uh, all of this, I guess, we're still waiting for uh, the next turn. We're going to be city. able to get another outpost, another city. So uh, we can definitely get another city right here, right? Oh, for that, we need, it to, we need us to have that much influence. That's a lot of influence. So for now, it's going to just stay as an, an outpost for now, it looks like, because I don't have enough, near enough influence to do anything. So I, I'm going to keep it like that. And I'm going to go towards this direction, just so I can actually, you know, get another outpost going and secure these borders, really. So I'm going to go towards there and uh, start seeing uh, where I could possibly get an outpost. Uh, right here. So where would it be secure for me to get an outpost? So it says plus two right here. Uh, plus four, plus four. That's a really good one right there. Uh, we've got plus three, plus three, plus two, plus one, plus two right here, plus three. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff. I think I'm going to go here. This is definitely one of, uh, where I want to go. So definitely want to go towards uh, that place. That seems like a really nice place to settle in or get another outpost uh we with this guy are gonna go ahead and uh move so we're gonna keep moving uh south really quick don't know what these resources we got horses but we need domestication in order to actually get these resources so can't until we have researched that uh technology which is going to take another eight turns we can't uh get those resources boys so i'm actually I'm going to combine these two armies. I'm going to combine you really quick. There we go. So now there are four of them in the same place. So they're all four of them are the same place. That's fine. And I've got my other one, right? I need to move. 
Yeah, this guy needs to heal up. But I don't, I'm not sure how I'm going to do that exactly. I need to move back right, uh, really quick. I really need to move back. Uh, I, I can't go into the shore, right? Because I don't know. Yeah, I don't know how to uh, to embark and stuff. So in order to for me to heal up, I probably got to go in there into a friendly territory and try and heal myself up maybe. Nope. All right. So I, I want to see. Do I have... I want to do really quick uh, something. I want to get a treaty. Are you with me? Trade everything. Or open borders. So right now we can't trade anything. I would like to do that. I, I would like open borders, please. For uh, 20 turns, she's gonna ex uh, 20 gold. She's gonna accept. Fantastic. So we got open borders now, which is fantastic. Just gonna go ahead and do that. And uh, now that we got open borders, I can go in here and maybe chill a little bit. I can pass through. It's going to make it a bit easier for me to to chill a little bit, right? So we're definitely going to do that. So now I've got open borders with her, which is fantastic. We've got uh, that. We already uh, did our thing. So I'm just going to go ahead and end the turn really quick. All right. So we are entering now the 33rd ter um, uh, turn. We've got this little population right here. What do we want to do with these guys? Uh, these uh, little guys. We need to heal them up actually because yeah, they do need to chill. But uh, I need for them. What I need from them is to actually create the outpost, right? So I need to. Uh, I need for them to create uh, the outpost right here. That's the fort. Yeah, boom, just like that. So there's a third outpost, boys. Just like that, we got a really good one. Now we're secured pretty much across the board, all across the board right here. It's gonna take a seven seven turns for it to be built but uh we're gonna be fine and these guys uh, i need them to heal up just because that's what they are used for as well right i need uh my units to heal up so that's why i need as many outposts as possible for in order to for my units to be able to do stuff so i gotta move no matter what i do i gotta move down so it's gonna take an entire entirety of a turn to do that so now can uh i can't go there i can't do anything with them so unless i attack a surprise attack i don't want to do that uh, i can't do anything still gaining some gold uh five culture per turn which is quite a lot boys we are starting to gain some culture uh let me see what i can do right here with these guys let's keep moving south keep exploring a little bit there's doesn't seem like to be a whole lot of things uh to do right now we do have Urals discovered, so we uncovered something. Uh, we got something right here, dry glass. Uh, I do want to explore that. I do want to see what this is all about. So let's do that. Uh, let's take a look at my city really quick. I really want to see if uh, everything's right. So for this outpost, going to need a lot of points. Yeah, so I can't really do too much with it. Um, but it's going to get in 11 uh, turns. It's going to get a population. And same thing for this city right here. In 19 turns, it's going to get another population. Really want the city growth to work. Somebody to work on that. We can get maximum two people to work on each thing. So, yeah. That's kind of crazy, man. We're doing a lot right now. We can get all these things. So, we got four food, eight of industry. We're not really building too much. Uh, it's pretty much the same that it's been for a while now. Um, I'm not sure how to upgrade anything to be honest. Uh, I guess we just gotta keep moving and keep waiting, right? Uh, I guess um, um, having a mod at this point would be great. Possibly just to get production going and stuff, but uh, we're not gonna cheat too much. I'm gonna let it go. Uh, we got society, so what is that? Two turns? Converting to the Zao? Okay, so our culture, so. This is going to convert. This one's going to convert in four turns to the uh, the culture. And this one in ten turns to culture. So that's really good. We're pretty close for both of us. That's why I'm trying to do that. I'm trying to stay close as much as possible. We've got uh, some influence right here. Here and there. So we're doing alright. All right, so let's keep the uh, skipping turns, boys. We don't need to waste too much time right here. That's not a whole lot to do anyways. All right, boys. So new grievance available. So what is that? You may ask for reparations. What does that mean? I'm not sure what that means exactly, but uh, we'll see. 
So I've got uh, my army right here still healing up. So regroup. It's uh, it's still doing its thing. It's still he healing up. So we're going to keep it right here. Uh, what about uh, anybody else? So another eight turns. Man, eight turns is a lot. And how many gold will it take for it to be upgraded? 145. Good lord. It's going to take a long time for this to be built. Just for one thing, boys. Imagine. It takes a lot. It really does. Open battle. Wait. Why am I in war with them right now? What are they attacking me for? Okay, open confrontation. So we don't have a non-aggression pack. It's just skirmishes, I imagine. That's what's going on. I'm going to do manual battle because this seems to be not in my favor. And uh, that explains it a lot. I'm going to I'm gonna go into my outpost real quick. End the deployment. Uh, there we go. So I'm going to end the deployment. Uh, I'm not sure what's going on here. Uh, it's just a skirmish, I guess. We don't have a non-aggression pack. So I imagine they're just trying to, to get me because of that. I am going to definitely die if I do that. I'm definitely going to die. I need to heal up. Yeah, I need to defend. So hold position to this round is not move. Yeah, I will benefit from a comeback strength bonus. I need to uh, hold my ground right here. That's all I need to do, really. Reinforcements, support. I don't have any reinforcements, so I'm gonna... I really need to hold it out, boys, as much as possible, really. Need to hold it out. Let's see. They're probably gonna kill me. Yeah, they killed me. So I dealt a lot of damage to them, but there's not a whole lot I could have done right there. My arm... My uh, army right there was... My scout was already pretty much defeated. So that's my first loss. My first ever loss, so... I guess I have, I got, I got open borders with them. Doesn't mean they can't attack me though. We don't have a non-aggression pack, so we can attack each other if we want. Which is not a good thing, boys, but uh, oh well. All right, so we got animal remains, which is very good. Plus eight of uh, science and eight, uh, uh, ten of that, which is very good indeed. How do I move up to another era? I'm, I really do wonder, boys. I imagine uh, it doesn't have anything to do with it anymore. I'm not. I'm not sure how it goes, but let's uh, let's see really quick. So this army, I'm. I need to get revenge for what they did to my my other scout right here. They killed my scout. I don't like that. But I don't want to go to war with them. I, I really don't want to. I'll just let them be for now. Let them be and uh, let them do whatever they want. So uh, now that that is done, we still got. Nothing else, really. We're still working on all of this. Uh, I've got 20 gold. I really want to do a treaty of some sort that would allow them to give me money, right? So let's try and make it so that we are as friendly as possible. Greetings, so, sovereign. crisis? What is this? We got a crisis going on? Oh, we got a grievance because they attacked me. That's right. So you attacked me. So your grievances. Attack one of your armies. Demand. Pay. Yeah, you pay me. You gave me 200 goals, all right? Demand. Renounce. I'm going to demand it. I've got a grievance against them. I'm going to demand that they give me 200 goals. You uh, you pay me 200 goals, all right? Or it's going to be bad for you, all right? So that's, that's all I'm going to say. I'm going to start a war with you if you don't pay me right now. You got to pay me, my girl. Uh, treaties. Otherwise... I would be willing to trade with you. It doesn't seem like right now we want to. They want to do any trades. Uh, so we have already interacted with them. It looks like so that's fine. We don't have anything else. So let's skip the turn again. Now I wonder, are they gonna give me the two hundred golds or what's gonna happen right here? Right? I wonder. There's fireworks right here. Some sort of big celebration or anything? I'm not sure what's going on over there, but they're celebrating somehow. Even though I just asked them to give me money. So let me let me go right here. And we're going to keep researching. We got a bunch of stuff. Uh, brand new stuff that uh, we're uncovering right here. Uh, resources and all that good uh, uh, stuff. So that's really good. My army right here is completely healed up. Which is fantastic. So what we want to do. Is we want to keep moving. And we are going to start mobilizing maybe. Or maybe just get another outpost. Yeah, with this guy, I want to get as many outposts as possible. So get another one over here somewhere. Like over here somewhere, right? Oh, uh, 170? Okay, never mind. Let me uh, let me just move there first. With this army. Hold on. 
Move there. Come on, uh, dude. You got this. We're gonna move here. We're still in our territories. I don't want to. I don't want to ransack my own territories. That would kind of be stupid. So let's go ahead and go right here. Just like that. All right. So still another seven turns for this to be built. Open the list of agent outposts, uh, adjacent outposts to attach to the city. So I can decide to attach uh, to one of these cities. I want to obviously uh, attach these two. So attach this. Outpost uh, per thing. So attach this one. So focus on the camera. Can I attach them? Or how does it work exactly? Attach territory. So obviously I want to I want to focus on food or... Oh, I need 60 for that. So cannot do that until I got enough. So I'm going to need 60. Once I get 60 of influence, I'm going to be able to attach uh, them to that, which means they're probably going to get some more resources and it's going to help each other out, I guess. I'm, I'm guessing that's how it works. So I definitely want to do that uh, for sure. I'm guessing this should probably be my second city, to be honest. And this right here should be just a regular outpost. I think that would be the best of options right here. What about here? How many more turns? 17 turns. Yeah, everything takes forever in this game though. Literally everything takes forever to be built or to have the population or anything. It's crazy. As we enter turn 36, even the coal, uh, the science, uh, like the progress and stuff, you can see we're not very far away. We don't have a lot of science, so we're not literally researching stuff quick enough. We got domestication in two turns coming up, but that's I mean, it's taking so long for that to uh, to happen. Uh, we still can't connect these uh, these ones. I can't attach anything because yeah, obviously I don't have 60 of things, so that's fine. You are gonna keep moving towards the south, I guess, and uh, you're gonna uh, I guess ransack if you can. You can't, so it cannot be done as any valid target here. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, there's another civilization over here, by the way. Another uh, civilization on the other continent, uh, for sure. I haven't uh, discovered yet, so I'm uh, quite intrigued by that. What about this army right here? I definitely would like to. I would like to know what this is all about first. So I would like to encounter this. So domestication research, good. So now we got some extra science from uh, getting that and now we got domestication which means we can get animal barns we can get scout riders which probably are faster which is very good and we've got horses resource which is uh, very good indeed as well so uh, we got all of that done which means we can uh, start attacking this mammoth right here we're gonna just do instant uh, resolution. We already uh, won that. There we go. Plus 20 gold just from that, which is fantastic. All of these guys are good, it seems like. So with that, uh, we're gonna need to see who do we, what do we want uh, next. The wheel is gonna take too long. Irrigation as well. Carpentry, city defense, calendar. Would give us granary, to be honest. And food would be very good just to have more people. Farmer slots, artisan, quarter and stuff. Warriors for city defense. Palisades and garrisons. I don't feel like I need that too much right now. So I'm just going to do this instead. The calendar. So we're going to be focusing on calendar, boys. Yeah, we only have three per turn of research right now. That's why it's taking quite a long time for us to research anything at all. And uh, the rest is fine, I guess, uh, for that. Yeah, it takes a lot of points that we need, but we're going to get there in no time for the 60 points, which I'm going to use to connect these two tiles together, uh, these two outposts. And what about you over here? How are you doing? You still need another six turns for your pottery thing. Uh, after that, we're going to be able to start working on the animal barns, which is going to be fantastic. We can also get scout riders, but for that, we need the actual horse resources. So... Resource access, I imagine now we can actually go and look for those. So there's one of them right there and we can definitely go and look for that. There is an event right here. So Salve for Blooded 2. So let's see what happened. The Elder prepared the poultress and applied it to the gash. For the first few days, little change could be seen in the wounded fighter. Her face spill, her body fever feverish, but come to the fifth day, her eyes open and you know 
you knew she would survive. It's a happy day. There you go. Rebirth. Minus 21% uh, research on the calendar research cost, which is fantastic, boys. So uh, it gives us a bonus on that, uh, on that part as well. All right. I think that's it. Let's skip the turn. All right. So we're in the next turn already, boys. Just as easy as that. Where's my other army that I was sending at? I think I was sending him uh, right here. Yeah. So this guy, we got a resource right here. We can't do anything with that, I'm pretty sure. Obsidian. Not sure if we can do anything with that. Let me just see really quick. Mm, uh, I think they already have the other guys. already have that though, the other civilization. I want to go for their horse resource. So with this guy, what I'm going to end up doing is just go all the way there. We're going to move him towards there. And uh, we are going to use them to go and get the, those resources along the way. Obsidian, maybe we can get that. You know, it would be great. So uh, now that we are getting that, uh, you over here, you're going to keep exploring. Or do you want to go back? We don't want to go too far away, I imagine. Because otherwise, it's gonna uh, we're going to miss on some things. I, I, I really want to just try and uncover as much as possible right here. But uh, not too much. I think that's all I got, really. I got four forces or something. Yeah, I got five units, basically. But uh, four of them on, are together. And the other one is literally moving uh, right there. So I'm missing some scouts right here, boys. I'm definitely missing it. And um, I got nothing else going on. Aesthetic, immediately uh, bring one of your empires uh, into your sphere of influence. So I could literally use that. Use some gold to do that. Uh, I still want to keep my gold though. Because I feel like the gold is going to be very important. I want to keep Reed doing some exchange with them. Still got a, a, a crisis right here. So uh, pay. So you demand that uh, they pay. Understood. There we go. Motive attack me. There we go. Understood. I wonder if they're going to pay me eventually though. Because I, I, I'm pretty sure they probably just don't have the money right now. But they got a kinship. So they are friendly to me. Yeah, they're very friendly to me, boys. So I just asked of them to, to pay me eventually. You know, it would be great. And the trades, I can't do any trades or anything. So really the relationship, there's not a whole lot that happen, that's happening. There's not a whole lot that we can do. We're just going to, we're going to wait it out. I don't have a, I, can, I guess I could do that. I could do the cultural bliss. So that would give us 100% right away. Yeah, we can do that, I guess. Boom. And let's do the cultural bliss for this one right here. Cultural bliss. So what, what does this do exactly? So I got another six turns to convert. This one is already converted. There we go. I want to influence it as much as possible, right? How do I do that? I'm not even sure how things work, boys, in this game. It's kind of weird. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I really don't know how to use that. Did I use my gold? Oh, I did use my gold. Okay. So I guess I used my gold and now I've got, uh, I'm part of the culture right here as well in that outpost. Which is interesting, I'm not sure how anything, any of this works exactly, but I mean it's definitely interesting. Let's go into that uh, thing, can we actually ransack this? We cannot, uh, off, obviously cannot ransack this place because we don't know anything about this. I can keep doing outposts right there though, that's definitely a good thing to do is Getting another outpost nearby. I can't get one. Oh, because I need more influence. Okay. Got enough outposts as it is, I guess. Let's get, let's keep moving then. With that army. And you are going to keep uh, moving towards there, I guess. There we go. We've got a lair right here. What is this? Ransacking. You can ransack animal sanctuaries, outposts, or city districts. Select the ransack action to army panel. And then uh, ransack. Yes. Uh, I'm going to go there. Obviously, I'm going to do it. Oh, there's a lot of centuries and lair that I can do. So let me go ahead and ransack this place. Boom. So it's going to take an entire turn for us to do that. We got a sanctuary. We got a lot of stuff right here that we can do. That's very good, boys. A lot of stuff. Different uh, things that we can do. Gaining more money and science because of that. And we do have the, um, the, uh, the stuff right there. So we can attach these guys together. So attach the outposts. Boom. Just like that, it has been attached. So now they're together, which means it's going to only help out each other. It's going to help out each other. And uh, its resources are getting to that one now. So that's really good. Still want um, the population to keep working on growth. But now with that, because it's attached, you can see we've got 22 of industry. 
11 of food, four of and four of each, basically, of money and science. Really good, boys. Now that's what I'm talking about right here. That's that's what I that's more like it right here. And two turns for the workshop to be completed. All right, ransacked successful uh, for that. Let me just uh, see really quick with this guy. We're gonna keep moving really quick. We're gonna keep moving towards that direction. Eventually, we'll get to uh, this place and we're gonna get that resource that we need. So th uh, that we so desperately need. Our uh, people right here are doing really good. We have one turn remaining for the pottery to be done. Eight turns for the calendar to be completed as well. So now that that is done, I mean, look at that. It's it's attached. Everything's good. We're gaining money, I guess. We're gaining more, uh, more money per turn now, which is always a good thing as well. So we are doing a little bit better. We just need to keep doing our thing, I guess. So... Now that it's all attached, what do we do? What if I um, forget out of here? And okay, so if I get into this, it's part of the, the whole thing. Okay, good. So that's uh, good. I want this, eventually this place to be my second city. If I can, otherwise I'll just attach it as well. So uh, we're going to go into the sanctuary right here. We're going to go right here into the sanctuary. Let's move, 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 move. And we are going to ransack this place as well so ransack the sanctuary as well boom it's going to take an entire term as well for to do that and that's just going to give us more money more stuff quicker and uh, we're going to be fine so that is done let's keep moving boys we are doing very good right now it seems like they got an outpost they're starting to build a second outpost right here uh slash shitty so uh they are uh my friends my neighbors are expanding as well so world deed locked wonderful lake healer has been locked by another empire okay i don't know what that means rent sacks a sex a successful really good okay so that's done we got uh this outpost has been completed boys so now we got uh, officially this outpost that's done and it does uh, give us that outpost uh does give us a couple more things some more influence i guess which is a very good so you can see right here is, is everything starting to uh, do uh, really good for us we're done with the pottery uh, workshop which gives us plus four influence on the main plaza that's what's giving us that for that we need horse resources so before i do anything i want to make sure that with my other unit i can't get there yet right so i can i can get that resource but how do I get it exactly? Because I, I think I need to get a second, my second city over here in order to get those horse resources, right? I'm pretty sure that's probably what I, what I gotta do somehow. So and until then, my guess is I guess I, I, I can just start focusing on these things. Uh, workshop would be really great or quarters if you want to call it just because it would allow me to get more production and more production is always good. Uh, I'm already doing very good on the production, but, you know, more would be good just to be able to build faster uh, things, you know. So I think that would be a good idea. But at the same time, having science as well, you know, for the research, food uh, would be great. I can't build anything that's for money. I think the science thing is the most important one, to be honest. It gives us more stability and stuff. Let me get the uh, the quarters though. I definitely think the quarters would be the best thing to get right now. Just because I need to have as many production as possible to be able to build stuff faster. So where do I want to build that? Where would I want to build that boys? It would take 8 turns no matter what. Uh, over here would give us plus 4. Plus 2 over here. Plus 3. Plus 1. Plus 1. And you can see what it's giving us minuses, right? So it does give us minuses in food and stuff somewhere. I, very, uh, I would very much like it to be built on the best place possible. Gonna be, I'm going to be building it right here. So this is going to be uh, the one. Um, there we go. So we're going to, we're building on that. It's going to take eight turns to be done. So we're going to be fine on that part. And uh, we're going to be able to attach this place. Not actually not. I'm not going to be able to attach this place at all, am I? No, because it's going to take 160 that I need, so... 
yeah that's gonna be uh that's gonna be rough that's for a long time ahead so we're gonna have to wait on that one we still got this army right here it has ransacked this place we had uh something going on right here uh didn't we didn't we yeah we had uh some sort of uh event or something animal remains plus 10 of science eight of things really good and we gotta keep moving really we gotta really keep moving i think uh just keep exploring keeping exploring is the best thing to do right now so let's uh let's do just that we're gonna head back i guess right here on that uh, location with these uh units got 50 of gold we're doing all right all right, so I think this is a good place to stop it right here. Not a whole lot happening. My city right here has a lot of range, as you can see, to the shores. Eventually, if we get fishing done or something, a fishing resource or discovery or something, we can probably fish on the seas and stuff. I have a lot of resource for that. Uh, same thing for the, uh, these guys. But right now, as it looks like I need some horse resource as well, eventually. Uh, that would very be uh, very much be helpful. So remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed. I'll see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.